Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're just joining me now then don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also follow me over on Instagram and TikTok if you're not already. Today I have got a, another Primark haul for you. I know I only done one of these about a few weeks ago but I literally can't help it. Right I am starting off with probably my favourite purchase of the haul and it is the viral Primark bag. Now I can't remember what this is a dupe for but I'm sure an expensive designer brand looks exactly like this and yeah it kind of went viral online on TikTok on Instagram and I had to have it because I am a sucker for things that go viral because yes I do hop on trends and I cannot help it it's an addiction but yeah normally I just buy something think about it might return it might not I don't think I'll return this one because I really like it I really like this and it's like the perfect tote bag size as well like it just sits under perfectly and yeah I really like this this was £12 and I think that is so well priced I've been on the hunt for this for ages I think it had already been like going viral for like the past few weeks and yeah couldn't find it anywhere but found it found it eventually so yeah I picked up this so so happy with it okay next item I picked up you're thinking why have you just bought a leopard print bucket hat <laughs> whilst I was traveling I loved wearing bucket hats I don't know why um only sunbathing this is or sometimes if I was out and about and I really didn't care what I looked like I would put this hat I would put a hat on or a bucket hat typically i did i think i had a cap with me as well pretty sure but yeah obviously when you're out and about in the heat you really don't want to um you really don't want to burn your scalp because if you've burned your scalp before it's one of the worst pains ever like it goes all flaky dry it's like raw red and obviously when you're brushing your hair as well it's not pretty so for when i go on my next holiday whenever that might be I will be wearing this bucket hat around the pool. But yeah, it's only for around the pool or on a beach when I'm sunbathing, reading a book, sipping a cocktail. But yeah, I actually, yeah, this was five pounds, as you can see there. Next thing I picked up, which is summer related, is a bikini. Now I have been looking at this for ages in Primark, and I was like, I was always like, oh, I don't need it, but it would be like the perfect tanning bikini and I picked it up because it was in the sale so I couldn't say no I picked this up in an extra small and um, the only thing is I don't know how much coverage it's gonna give or if it's gonna stay off um, or if it's gonna stay up I'm not sure I'm yet to try it on so yeah this is like the only thing I didn't try on to be honest and I didn't try on I'll show you in a second but yeah I picked this up and then these are the matching bottoms so I forgot to mention this was four pounds reduced from seven this didn't have a red sticker on it but these bottoms were three pounds and they were originally five but yeah I'm yet to try this on yet so yeah pick this up I feel like it's just the perfect tan bikini it's strapless next item I picked up is one of these infamous Primark underwear sets I've got this color this time I really like this color I'm hoping that you can see it on camera but it's like this creamy beige color essentially and this was six pounds so yeah they do these in so many different colors if you didn't know already but you probably do but yeah I really like this color Okay, so the item I didn't actually try on because I was I was filming an Instagram reel to upload, um, obviously on, on on a Primark call, and this didn't really go with what I was wearing, so that's why I didn't try it on. But it is literally just a basic gym top essentially, and um, it is from their workout section. I picked it up in an extra small, so it'd be super tight on me. But yeah, I just thought this would be perfect for lounge around the house in, wearing some leggings, wearing flared leggings. Flared leggings are like a massive trend at the moment, aren't they? And I do have a pair, just not from Primark. 
but yeah I just thought this would be cute to wear as a little set together and this was only £9. On the topic of gym wear I also picked up the same top but in this cream colour. I believe these are actually like the Adenola dupes, I swear someone said. And to be fair to them, these do feel exactly like the Adenola ones. I don't actually own a top from them, but I own the leggings. And I know they'd kind of be very, very similar material. So yeah, these feel super soft and yeah, extra small, £9. Can't go wrong really. They also had these in a few other different colours as well, but not many sizes left, annoyingly. Okay, the next item I have to show you, which is inside out, because I've tried this one on. I picked up this black knit sleeveless vest top. If you watched my previous Primark haul, I picked this exact top up in like a beige colour, and I'm, I was obsessed with it, and I still am, I've kept it. And I saw it in black and I immediately put it straight in my basket because I've already worn that beige top quite a few times since the Primark haul. So yeah, you know when you really love something and it, they bring it out another colour, I've just got to get all the colours. So yeah, they had this in black and this was £11. Got it in extra small. The beige top I bought before, I got it in a 2XS just because it was literally the last one there. And there was also a size extra large or something. But yeah, I opted for the smaller top. Um, but yeah, there's no 2XS in the blacks. So yeah, pick this up. Super happy with it. Next up, this is actually on the same vibe. So you know the beige top I was talking about. This is literally it, but in a dress form. So it is this long maxi dress. Um, long maxi knit dress and just goes all the way down and then it has a split at the side so it's easier to walk in you can see it on in the try on clip I got it in a extra small and this was £15 I just feel like this is a proper transitional piece you can still wear it in summer when it's on those colder chillier days or you can like wear this in autumn with some boots and like a jacket of some sort or even like put a long sleeved t-shirt under this would look cute um but yeah i picked this up okay next item i picked up is this cardigan now when i saw this i saw the blue and i was like oh that is the viral jumper and i did actually see it but i don't know why i didn't think to pick it up but next time i go in there and if i see it hopefully it's there i'm gonna pick it up but anyway I picked up this blue cardigan I really like the colour of this it's just like a bright blue just like a really happy happy colour isn't it um well yellow's a happy colour blue's meant to be a sad colour actually but I feel like this bright baby blue is a really nice colour like, very on trend at the moment isn't it like the buttons done up on a cardigan pair of jeans pair of trousers really nice got this in a size extra small and this was £13. And then I also decided to pick it up in the cream because apparently I needed both colours. You know? Um, I actually don't know why I picked this up because I have the exact same one. But it was from Zara last year. But I just thought I'd pick it up to show you guys I'm not going to keep it because I don't need it. I've literally got one exactly the same. And Zara is probably the nicer one to be honest because the buttons a cream but with this one they've got a bit of brown in it but yeah thought I'd show you that anyway last but not least we have another knit jumper it literally looks like a basic plain jumper in the front but in the back we have a cute little tie bow and they also had this in a green colour as well um just for reference and this was £17, which I think is quite pricey for Primark, and I think I'm going to return this, just because it's not giving how I wanted it to give. Um, but yeah, I've got this in a size extra small. And yeah, I'm not the biggest fan, but I thought this was quite cute. The bow was cute. The bow, the bow makes the jumper, to be honest, let's be real. Anyway, that is the end of my Primark haul. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. 
and also follow me on tiktok and instagram if you're not already and you'll probably see me very soon with another haul knowing me to be honest but yeah see ya